Okay, so we work our way into the 70s entrance. And as you see, we're at 1971 right now. We're gonna back up and show you three pretty significant names. Of course, every name in this place is significant. But here's the big one. And he's still with us today. It's amazing to think that Yogi Berra is still with us and all the deja vu all over again and all the, all the great phrases that he's come up with. But if you look down, we have Lefty Gomez, Sandy Koufax, who obviously everybody in Brooklyn you know, every Dodger of history knows who Sandy Koufax is, one of the most dominant pitchers in the history of our game. And as you work your way down to early win, here's the biggest name again. I mean, it's just, you can go back and forth, but of course, Roberto Clemente, you know, there's an award named after him, as we know, and what he went through helping uh, support relief in Puerto Rico and all the charity stuff that he did was tremendous. Uh, to lose him in that fashion, and just a simple plane ride where he was actually trying to do something good for everybody. Pretty devastating. Um, so we're, we're at 1973 right now. And I'm going to walk over here and we're going to show you what's going on over here. So 1974, big names. One of the biggest uh, for all of us Yankee fans who, who I, uh, unfortunately, I just got at the tail end of his career when I was uh, growing up. But Mickey Mantle, it was, it was 536 home runs, the amazing amount of stuff that he accomplished when he was growing up. Yeah. All of us remember him very well. His death was. Obviously tragic. Uh, he just had a, you know, he was he loved to drink. His uh, his playing days were uh, drinking. So he paid the price for it. That's okay. We still we love the Mick. All of us Yankee fans love Mickey Mantle. So work your way around. Lee Harmon. Look at this. I mean, now we're working our way into the late 70s and some of the most significant names that, uh, of all this generation. I mean, you think about Willie Charleston. You have Cal Hubbard here. Roger Connor. And here's another one that everybody should remember pretty well with, who just uh, passed away recently as well. Uh, I can. Let's play two. Ernie Banks. Uh, you know, it's, he, he will be missed. I mean, every Cub fan, but uh, it's really tough to watch. Uh, we will all miss Ernie Banks. I mean, everyone around here will miss Ernie Banks for years. Uh, a legend of this game. And what he means to Cub fans will, will never, ever go away. 